Hello and good morning. We are back. We are back from Vegas. I hope you are all doing well. Sorry, my voice is maybe a little bit off today, and I may be a little slower than usual, but uh, I woke up this morning thinking I had probably the best three days of my life. <clears throat> and to a man that's had an incredible life, that's saying quite, quite a bit. I first would like to, uh, I was going to do an apology video, and I don't, I'm not, I'm not, apolo I'm, I'm not doing that. I'm, I'm not, I'm not sorry about anything, and I'm not apologizing for one thing. Uh, I had said I was going to post uh, a more live content immediately to uh, my channel and uh, give you daily updates, and that did not happen. Okay, so let's um, let's clear this up right now. That that did not happen. That did not occur, um, and I'm not sorry one bit. And uh, you know, whatever. I. And I'm going to tell you why I'm not sorry about it. I spent uh, three to four days in Las Vegas. <laughs> I absolutely could not have uh, met more incredible and wonderful people than I than I would have ever even imagined. And the, the outpouring of family. It wasn't Alan worship or, you know, Brad Kimes worship or... You know, Brad Garling House. That 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 is. There was a little bit of that going on. You know, well, more Brad and Brad, but <laughs> but it was it was people and it was families and it was couples and and, and meeting other couples and being with other people and and spending time by the, all the way down from kids' age to eighty year old people sharing the the equal same passion about the same things they understand about what's coming for all of us. Um, I have to tell a story, and this video is going to be about the people of XRP. And first of all, let me backtrack just a little bit. Yes, I shot a ton of video. And yes, I will be posting it. And yes, I'm exhausted. As my film crew is, Thank you so much to Ron and Kat. I, you, you people have nothing more incredible than somebody flying half the, all the way across the U.S. to come do something so that you and I, every person that watches all of our videos, can have a better experience and asking for nothing in return from me. Can you imagine that? I, I, you know, I don't know what you do for a living, but could you imagine on your own dime flying all the way across the country and helping somebody just because you appreciate what they do? Like, I, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm at a loss for words uh, as to how powerful and meaningful this whole group of people is that we have. And, and if you don't... If, 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 if you don't feel that passion and that love that everybody has um, to make you, if you own two XRP coins, there's people that have your back here. There's people that want to see you succeed. They don't care what your political or beliefs or anything. Nobody cares. They just want to see you succeed and in that, I'd like to say this about succeeding. Um, I know there's a lot of people that could not afford to come, and I get that. And like I said in previous videos, that is the prudent thing to do for you and your family. And, and I applaud that. Good on you. Um, but try not to be the person on the keyboard who tells me how much smarter they are because they didn't go to an event like this um, and how many XRP you saved. I, I understand that, 
Okay, I do. Uh, but the one thing I know about this world and all the people in it is there are multi, multi millionaires and billionaires that I've worked for that don't have what I just experienced in the last three days. See, money and wealth doesn't buy you what just occurred over that weekend. It's, it just doesn't. I know rich people that don't even think they have a friend in the world. Because they, they just think that people around them, because they're around them because they're rich. And you know what? They're right. What we have in that room, what we have in this family, is way bigger than your wealth. Or how many digits you own, or how, how many cars you got. Or how big your house is. Nobody gives a damn about that. I don't care who you think you are because you have that. You know what you don't have? What I have. You know what I've got? I've got thousands of people that feel the same way about life and love and freedom and liberty and the future of our lives because of beautiful things like coins like XRP and our lives together. And we're going to make it happen together. That's what I got. I don't have a big bank account. There's, most of that show I couldn't go to because I thought to myself, well, you know, I, I could save, you know, 500 here and 600 there because I can feed a lot of people with that money. I get it. I understand what you're talking about. And then let's get to that. I heard so many people tell me, Alan, oh, my God, you're just a cheerleader. You're a cheerleader for XRP. No. No, I'm not a cheerleader. And I hear people say, oh, oh, you know what, Brad Kimes, hey, that guy, you know what that guy is? He's a used car salesman. No. No, that's not who that man is. That's not who it, he and I are. See, I'm a coach. I'm not a cheerleader. I know where the ball's going. I know how the game's played. And I know why you're in the damn game. And I know who's hustling and who's not. And you know who's hustling on the field? And you know who's kicking everybody else ass on that field? Brad. He's, he's hustling. He's staying after practice and working out for you, for the rest of the team. I saw him. Man, I, I swore to myself I was going to go to this show and I was going to outwork everybody. I'm going to outwork everybody. I'm going to shake every single hand and meet every single person I possibly can. And you know what? I'm trying right now to figure out how next year's show for 72 hours I can do without sleep. That's what I'm trying to figure out right now. Because I didn't get to everybody. I got to, I don't know, 70% of the people. I did. I, I you know. I was the last person on that convention hall because I just figured there was somebody. Somebody was standing back that like hadn't met me or wanted to or, you know, wanted to send a picture back to his wife or his friends or something like that. And he was just shy or just didn't want to talk and was waiting for the room to clear. That's what happened at that show. You know, I, I, I'm not trying to, you know, pat myself or anybody else on the back with this one. I'm just telling you what happened. This is my true raw. I drove all day getting home, got home late last night, went straight to bed, and I'm getting up and I'm doing this video. And uh, again, I apologize for my voice, but I, I'm not sorry that I didn't, I, I didn't post more live video streams. We recorded so much gold, people. Gold of people who you don't know. You're going to know, I don't even know why I don't interview that. I don't know who that person is. Gold. People. I met people. People. I didn't meet celebrities. I didn't meet Brad Garland. I met people. I met the people of XRP. And I interviewed those people. 
I, yeah, I interviewed some channels and some people and some couples, some behind-the-scenes people that you're going to not know. Okay, you might know their husband because he's on YouTube, but you won't know his wife or something like that. I got a bunch of that. Okay, I got great interviews of people that you're going to know and you're going to love the shows. I have, I don't know, I looked it up. I, I think we recorded 12 hours of material, okay, in two days. Okay, we have all that coming. You haven't missed anything. All of that's going to be there. <clears throat> I almost forgot. Okay, this lady. I'm going to shout out and have permission to use her name as she knows exactly who she is. Clearly does not have a lot of money. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not sure I could do this. It came up to me, got up every morning early so that um, she could meet me. Um, but when I got there, and uh, her mom is sick, and uh, she's taking care of her mom. And the first thing she does is apologize for not knowing English, or not much English. By the way, your girl... Girl, your English was perfect. Um, and all she wanted to do was meet me. And she did that both days. You know, she wasn't wandering around trying to meet 15 other people. We're in this together. Do you understand? Do you understand who you are? <laughs> Do you understand that, that people that are like that is who your best friend is now? Do, do you understand that there's not much of that in the world? You know, the blessings of us all come to us in so many magical and amazing ways. And um, count them. Count them all the time. Count them every moment of your life, every single day. With your friends and your family and pet your dogs. I, Bruno's not here today. Well, he's outside chasing squirrels or whatever he's doing. I just want to thank the many people, and they know, all know who they are, that came to me, that di did me favors of allowing me to help bring them to you in the days to come. Could be weeks. It's going to be weeks, guys. We have so much content that we're going to bring to you in a relaxed setting where it's just me and Brent chilling out, talking to these people, and people some you're going to know and some you're not going to know. And the amount of info isn't going to be revolutionary, cutting edge. Oh, I know the, the, what's going to happen in the world tomorrow because I, I watch. But you're going to understand the people and the passion behind the XRP family. And I highly urge and encourage all of you to find a way to do local meetups, to do whatever you have to do. I understand you can't go to Vegas. So many people cannot pull that off. And I get it. And you did the prudent thing. But one day you're going to be very wealthy. And that day is coming, my friend. <laughs> oh, my God. How can it not happen? You tell me how there's going to be all those people with all that spirit and all that soul and all those people manifesting things in their life in that room for 72 hours. That energy is emitting out of that building. Out of six, eight hundred people were there with the same passion. Do you know with the vortex of energy and that cone that just gets directly through that building? 
up into God's eyes and love and passion. You don't think that's happening? You don't think all that energy in one room is powerful? Come on now, you've been to a church with 800 people in it. Just imagine that. And you think that's not going to succeed? You know, you're, you're one of those people down there that you'd love to, you know, chat how, you know, XRP is going to fail one day. You know, you're that person that's going to post down below this video. Okay. You know, okay. Good for you, man. Good for you. Yeah. I'll take that bet any day. You're in trouble, my friend. If you think that you're going to succeed, or crypto is all going to go to wherever it's going to go, and XRP isn't going to be leading that, or one of the leaders in that, I believe you're wrong. And I, I believe I met enough people that have the passion and the love and the compassion for the fellow man, not just the people with XRP. Anyway, I'm rambling on now. And my voice is getting better, so I'll probably shoot another video tomorrow. But I am uh, pleased to say that we got a lot of video. It's coming to you. There's going to be great content coming. The normal content, but other stuff too. We're going to drop it like it's hot. And you're going to love what you got. Because I've seen it. I looked at it, and it's a lot of fun. All right, guys. Uh, with that, I'm going to have to cut this one out, and I hope you got something from this video. If you did, please like and subscribe, and I will be back. Love you all. So my uh, wife is a uh, poker player, and uh, I had a little thought in my head, and by the way, she won a poker tournament over the weekend while we were in Vegas. Thank God I don't play cards on that table. I fear that woman on the card table, I'll tell you. And it dawned on me, I thought, there's an analogy here. And I got it. It came to me. XRP family. You own a royal flush, a sire, brothers and sisters. Do not fold your hand. In fact, I wouldn't say not to go all in. I'm just saying, I, don't fold your hand. This is the time to just be patient. Sit back and push your chips forward. Again, not financial advice. Love you all.